Hi, this is Peter. Today I want to introduce you is the uh, um, Synroid EVF which is made in Korea. And uh, what, is a, what is the EVF? The EVF is an electronic wheel finder. So why I need an EVF? Especially, okay, I can put on maybe onto a loop and then which you, I can using the screen and then to do the focus. True, okay. But the camera cannot give you like maybe a peaking, can you do, cannot to give you an extension light focus and then you also cannot give you a zebra and false color. So for this information which you can add on to uh, the EVF and then which is more useful for you to do the, um, the focus and also to get you a right exposure on the DSLR view. And um, for this setting you will see this is an EVF from Cineroid and then I put on a, a Genus uh, um, swing arm and then which I can adjust the, uh, the the angle and also all the stuff and also I put on um, a patent uh, mark from Cineroid which is actually putting onto it and then you can actually lock the HDMI connector because sometimes you will find out the connectors uh, onto the um, for example like 5D, 7D or even D800 is quite easy to just like get banded and then and then the connectors get broken and then you have to pay like several thousand Hong Kong dollars to just like fix it and then this is a real panic so for this one you can actually they have actually making a mount to lock this pin which make you much like solid to do the um, to, when you're using the um, the HDMI connectors and um, yeah other than the DSLR you can also put on like a lot of like professional camera for example like um, um, F3 from Sony, FS100, FS700 also from Sony, and then like maybe a C300, C500 from Canon. So on the on this EVF, the functions and also the um, the setting is pretty simple. So on one of the side, you see there is um, just the on off button. You can go to the menu and then, for example, like you set for the light, uh, the uh, the zebra, the false color, the peaking, or something else. And then for the other side, it's actually all the uh, fast key. For example, peaking and then the F1 to F3, you can set whatever light functions you want. And also at the back here you will see there is actually a HDMI in and also out. So that means you can actually get like a loop through out to a monitor, maybe to the, uh, to, for the director or maybe for, for other purpose. And uh, the batteries that it use is same as 5D Mark II. So for, in the front, you can actually adjust the, um, um, your, um, when you are just like, not like us, I'm, I'm wearing glasses and then you can just adjust your the distance and then to uh, when you just like take off the glass want to straightly use the EVF. Other than that, you can also take away the uh, the functions and then you can just clip on uh, using as just like a 3.5 inch monitor. So as I said, one of the side, one side of the buttons is actually the uh, um, the quick key. So for example, you can add on like a peaking, which for example, when you show the items, or the subject is in red color and then it's actually in focus. And also you can have like the other function, you can add on like a zoom in, at the same time you can actually just do like uh, a peaking at the same time, so to get a much uh, uh, precise focus. At the same time, rather than light focus, you can also get like uh, a false color. For example, like this, you see the colors is actually changing. At the same time, you can also using a zebra to just like get a, a correct exposure. So now I'm put on the EVF onto uh, F3. So it's uh, more look like uh, a, a professional camera and uh, you will ask why I want to put on an EVF especially those camera will have like a wheel finder so okay yeah you will find out when you use it you will see actually there is a big difference when using an EVF okay like this and then you can actually using the the, uh, the swing arm from Genus and then you can set whatever angle you want to do and then it's much easier and then you will actually holding your camera much closer to your body and then it's easy to do the pan and tilt shots but for if I using the back 
holder like this and then I have to hold my hands and then and then it do all the shots like this and which is not really user friendly and uh, and then the other thing is okay I, I, I can use the monitor here like that and then true but if you're in a bright sunlight and then how can you just like maybe see like when you got a lot of reflection and then maybe the, um, the outdoor is too bright so that's why the EVF is so useful. So for more information, you can visit our ANS website.